there, friends! My name is May, and I'll be leading the way along with my sidekick, Bloop. Bloop, come on out and say hello to our new friends. Hello there, everyone! Bloop here, ready for another fun day! Bloop and I have so many fun things planned. We're going to play games, sing songs, and collect tickets that will help us get a big, special prize at the end of our day. Oh, what fun! Mayday! Mayday! Oh, did you hear that, Bloop? Bouncing bubbles! I sure did. That sound means someone needs our help answering a question. Hey, May. Hey, Bloop. My name is Rico. I have a question. Where can I talk to God? Hip, hip, hooray, May! What a great question they've asked. Do you think we can answer that question today? I sure do. First, we need to think about where an answer might be. Hmm. Bloop, where do you think would be a good place to look for an answer? Oh, oh, what about a song? Do you think we can find our answer in a song? That's a great idea. Singing songs to God is always a good thing to do. Bouncing bubbles! Let's sing one now! the jungle, we can sing and talk to God wherever we are. And look, we got our first ticket too. Grab that ticket and put it in your pocket. We can use it for a prize at the end of the day. Oh yay! What a happy day! May, do you think the only place we can talk to God is in the jungle? Like in our song? I don't think so, Bloop. Maybe there's somewhere else we can look. Hmm, can you think of another place we could look for an answer to the question, where can I talk to God? Oh, oh, I know. God's word is full of answers to all kinds of questions. Great idea, Bloop. The Bible is the best place to go for answers. Let's look there now. Bouncing bubbles. Boys and girls, if you're ready to take a look into the Bible with us, say, The Bible is the book for me. The Bible is the book for me. Hello, friends. The Bible has many answers for you and me. If you're ready to hear a story from the Bible, let me see you click on your listening ears. Click, click. Oh, and you can't forget your special eyes. Let's put those on now. Zoop, zoop. You're definitely ready. I want to tell you today's Bible story with stickers. So many of my stickers have Jesus on them. Jesus knew that we can pray anywhere. Let's look at some places where Jesus prayed. Sometimes Jesus prayed when he was in a crowd of people, like the time he told God, thank you for the food a little boy was sharing with everybody. 
And there was one time when Jesus was with a bunch of boys and girls and he prayed with them too. But most of the time, Jesus liked to pray all alone in a place where he could talk to God by himself. Jesus said, anywhere you can be alone is the best place to pray. And look at where Jesus was praying. He was praying outside. You can pray outside too. Like when you take your dog out to play, you can talk to God about your day. Or when you're climbing up a tree, you can tell God, thank you for all that you see. You can even pick flowers and say, God, who should I give these to? No matter where you are, you can talk to God like Jesus did. There are so many places you can pray. You can talk to God in your living room, when you're snuggled up on the couch with your cat. You can talk to him at the dinner table and tell him thank you for your food. You can say, hey God, please keep me safe when you're swimming in the ocean or the lake. And you can pray at school. When your best friend isn't there to play, you can say, hey God, and talk to him because he's your best friend too. You can even tell God thank you when you go to a play and meet your favorite princess. Do you think you can talk to God in your bed at nap time or when you go to sleep at night? Yes! You sure can! God is listening when you talk to Him and you can talk to God anywhere! Wow! What a great story! And look! We got another ticket because we learned about the many places that we can talk to God. Go ahead and put that ticket in your pocket for later. Oh, yay, May! We can talk to God anywhere. You're right. I think we should celebrate what we've learned so far today. Hmm, can you think of something we could do to celebrate? Oh, hey, I say we play. Let's spin the wheel for a game. That's such a great idea, Blue! Oh, happy day! Everyone, stand up and play a game with May! The wheel landed on Pet Squad! This means that we're all going to pretend to be a special animal helper on the Pet Squad. Stand up and be the Pet Squad with me now! You come along, it's time to have some fun. When we're on the pet squad, we can help anyone. Let's have a dog on good old time. We'll do some rescuing. Won't you come along with me? God made the animals that we'll see. Put up your paws and pretend to be a kitty. God made the animals that we'll see Wiggle your tail and pretend to be a puppy God made the animals that we'll see Jump around and pretend to be a frog Won't you come along? It's time to have some fun When we're on the pet squad We can help anyone Let's have a dog on good old time. We'll do some rescuing. Won't you come along with me? God made the animals that we'll see swim all around and pretend to be a fish. God made the animals that we'll see flap your wings and pretend to be a bird. God made the animals that we'll see Hop up and down and pretend to be a bunny Won't you come along? It's time to have some fun When we're on the pet squad We can help anyone Let's have a dog on good old time We'll do some rescuing Won't you come along with me? Whoa! 
well. Bouncing bubbles. That was great. And look at that. We got another ticket. Grab it and put it in your pocket. We'll save it for a prize later in the day. We got a ticket because we learned that we can talk to God anywhere. We can talk to him when we're in our room pretending to be the pet squad, and we can talk to him when we're outside with our dog. We can talk to God anywhere. We can even talk to God when we are at our friend's house playing leapfrog. Ribbit. You're right, Bloop. There's a super special verse in the Bible that tells us more about talking to God. Say it after me. No matter. No matter. What happens. What happens. Tell God. Tell God. About everything. About everything. Philippians 4, 6. Philippians 4, 6. Hey, May. I know a song that teaches us all about that. That's great news, Bloop. Let's sing it together now. I can pray when I'm mad, when I'm worried, when I'm sad. I can pray any time, day or night will be just fine. Close my eyes, picture Jesus in my mind. I can't ask for what I need, I can trust He's listening. I won't worry about a thing, I can tell. and see if we can get a special prize to help us remember all we've learned today. Oh, bouncing bubbles! I love prizes! Me too, Bloop! Let's count and see how many tickets we have. Boys and girls, count with me. One, two, three! We have three tickets. Let's see what prize we can get with our three tickets. Hmm. It looks like there's a toy car for three tickets, a balloon for two tickets, and a piece of candy for one ticket. Boys and girls, do you see which prize we could get for the three tickets we have? The car! We have three tickets and the car costs three tickets. We can trade in our tickets for this super fun car. 
Oh, happy day, May! We got it! Now we will always have this special prize to remind us that we can talk to God anywhere we go. Oh, we need to call Rico back and tell him that we found the answer to his question. Hey Rico, I just want to tell you that we found the answer to your question. You asked, where can I talk to God? And now we know, you can talk to God anywhere. Wherever you go, God is there. He's always listening and talking to you too. And we got this super fun car to help us remember that we can talk to God anywhere. Wait, so you're saying I can talk to God while I'm here in time out? You sure can. Okay, you guys pray with me. Hey God, I'm so sorry. Please help me obey. I love you, amen. Amen. What a great prayer, Rico. Today we learned, I can talk to God anywhere. Now you say it. I can talk to God anywhere. That was great. Now say it in your loudest voice. I can talk to God anywhere. Good job. Now give us your best singing voice. I can talk to God anywhere. Well, bouncing bubbles. What a great way to end our day. You got that right, Blue. We can remember that we can talk to God anywhere. He's always listening, and he's even talking to us. It's time for us to go, but we hope to see you on our next play day. Bye-bye.